hi happy monday so this is going to be just some general messages y'all i did post a read yesterday and it was like a weekly read basically i put the dates into the title but um this is just going to be for whoever could be needing to hear a message or whenever you come across this video i do want to share though um not really sure what this is about y'all i got i kind of got an idea but i was like i don't know because it's kind of like with what's going on in the media and stuff like in the news it's kind of hard to believe the situation because it's like nobody really knows the full details or whatever but no um early this morning in the spirit like i was still in a dream state basically but i could hear somebody saying like what if he's innocent so I don't know if somebody asked that question or they could have been thinking it or whatever. I can't read minds, but that's what I was hearing specifically. And I didn't hear nothing else. That was basically it. That was like, what if he's innocent? That was it. Um. So yeah, that's very interesting. I ain't pulling no cards on it. I may do it later. I don't know. Because I don't know what the situation is, but somebody's trying to, like, somebody could be wondering, like, or, you know, other people could be wondering, too. So it's like, what if he's innocent? Okay. Um... Give me a message out for the collective for whoever comes across this video. So we got the moon card showing up. We got the hang one coming out too at the bottom. So for some people, you could be feeling like in a sense all tied up in, a, in regards to a situation. I feel like there's been a pause to possibly even reflect. You could be kind of like thinking, contemplating about a situation with the moon card coming out here though. I'm seeing a situation, y'all. This is this looks crazy. If you are somebody with um spiritual gifts, like you could be very intuitive, you could receive prophetic dreams. I was not even trying to like when I saw, I was like, uh, it's like something I don't want to see, but I can't help but to see it. So I'm gonna just go ahead and say it. But you could be somebody who has like prophetic dreams, but basically it's like you're showing up as like a martyr. I think that's how you say it, like a martyr or whatever. Like basically somebody who believes in something like whatever it is. Um, but specifically when it comes towards like dreams, it's like you um, you can see past the illusions basically. And you could definitely be a seer, but no, there's like certain energies with the moon card coming out. The way it's showing up here is like definitely some low vibrations, low vibrations type of energy. This could even too show up as like um, certain spirits. But they're projecting. They're sending negative energy. It, it literally shows where it's like um, people are playing in somebody's um, energy. But it's like they're they're sending um they are sending negative energy. Um evil eye could be significant too. Ooh, if you've been having like interruptions with your dreams too, y'all, this read could be for you too. It's like you know how you know you had a dream, right? But it's like you can't quite remember like certain details about it. It just seemed like it's almost like it literally leaves your brain. Or almost like something done took it out of your brain to where you just completely forget. Like you done got your memory erased. That could be significant too. But it's definitely um very spiritual from what I'm seeing here. That's what it's giving. It's like, you know how they did Jesus Christ? And I'm not even about to get into that, y'all. Because all this year I've been kind of talking about that. And I be still seeing it too. It's like people love to bring up Jesus and the Lord. In, in 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 the midst of their wickedness and i just don't understand it it's really funny actually the same ones they be talking about oh jesus got me whole time it's like they actually doing what the people did to jesus but let's see what else comes out what else are they needing to hear tell me about the moon card what is this moon card energy about you can definitely feel it though um, and it's like, I would mention something about like the return to center thing, y'all, but I had already kind of spoke on that. It's like my point of view is changing in regards to that. There could just be a need to pray about it, honestly. Um, definitely Psalms 23. For some people, you could be wanting to read Psalms 23.
but there's definitely some things, some spiritual things going on, even like in a dream state too. Cause this kind of looks like, um, you know, how you have like a weird dream. It's like, you may have a dream that somebody's like wearing some type of mask or just like looking super weird. It's like whatever it is that you are dreaming about. So definitely pay attention to your dreams. So let's see, even like people, Ooh, people even popping up in your dreams too, y'all. If you ever had that happen to you, um, and I never spoke on this before because I was like, I don't know if this person has like seen my channel because the way they be looking at me be like a little off. I can tell because I don't know, you know, who this person is. Like, you know, I never, um, it'd be like a brief interaction or whatever. But this person popped up in my dream, y'all. I could not believe it. That's why I was like, yeah. And it, it's, it got to be coming from, like, my channel. Because I'm like, well, how in the world would they, like, it's like, what, what what was their point of popping up in my dream? They popped up in my dream. And this was, like, a very prophetic type of dream, too, because it was, like, very vivid. It felt like it actually happened. But they when they popped up in my dream, it's like we were in the car, and they were in the front seat. I was like, Wow. And then when I saw the person, the, I, when I saw the per the next time I had saw the person, I was looking at them and tell me why it looked like something was going on with them. Like something had happened to them. I cannot even make this up. I can't, I don't want to give full details on it because I was like, I'm not going to speak about it because I don't know if they, cause you know how like when people do stuff like that, they don't know if you saw them or whatever, but no, it's like me and a person was together in a dream. Like they popped up on me and it's like, they was trying to be in control of like they was like in my car literally like in the front seat right here but it wasn't good energy it, was, it wasn't good vibes it's almost like they felt some type of way because some of these witches and warlocks be walking amongst you But yeah, it looked like something had happened to them. And I was like, yeah, see, that's why you ain't supposed to be jumping at people's dreams and stuff, trying to attack them. But I ain't say nothing. I just look like I, I showed no type of fear because I was like, yeah, let me uh, fix my facial expression. Like make it seem like, you know, yeah. Tell me about the moon card for the collective. I ain't mean to. <laughs> I ain't mean to uh, start talking about that, y'all. But no, it's like this would be really happening. People like to play around in the spirit. Tell me about the moon here for the collective. Yeah, look, it's because you're on the right path. There's a need to definitely trust your intuition, y'all. Follow your dreams or pay attention to your dreams because it, it looks like here, you may feel like for some people, you could be kind of like unsure about the direction you're going in, right? But it's like your intuition is your inner GPS. Because the it's like you may not have no type of map or, you know, back before they had... um. I don't know if they had the um, Google Maps or whatever, but just let's just say like back before it was any type of like GPS system, people just had maps, right? But it's like, you may feel like you don't have nothing like that either. There could just be a need to follow the guidance that you're receiving, um, especially when it comes towards, um, cause it kind of looks like someone's maneuvering in the darkness. And the way it's showing up here, it's like, you are the light. Divine feminine energy could be significant too. Um, because the moon is showing up here. Because it looks like they're looking at the moon. But it's like a figure. Like the face is a, um, on the moon. So that's letting me know it's like feminine energy. But you could be masculine too watching this. But um, anybody who is connected. You know super connected with their intuition. Like you're super in tune. Like you can feel when something's not right. You can feel like. Um, you could definitely like read energy. Um, you can tell when somebody could be sending you the evil eye or whatever the case is. That's what it's looking like. But it looks like someone's maneuvering, maneuvering in the darkness, like trying to find their way. And for some people low key, because of like the projection and like the bad vibes, you could be thinking that you're on the wrong path too, but there could be a need to walk away from certain situations as well. Um... 
Let's see. Also, unknown territory could be significant too because it kind of looks like someone's maneuvering um, through the darkness right on their path. It's like sometimes the path be looking kind of dark too. So it's, it's like, it's not all light, rainbows and sunshine like at all, but it's like, you're gonna make it through. So there could be a need to trust yourself. So let's see what else comes out. Tell me more about the moon for the collective, please. Tell me more about the moon. So we have the Ace of Wands coming out. And we got the chariot showing up here too. So it looks like you're on a move, y'all. But it does look like there could be some like, um, it looks like there's a lot of things hidden. But with the Ace of Wands coming out, it looks like there's some good news surrounding this too. Things look kind of off energetically. Like, what is going on? Let me see. I'm going to ask. I'm going to actually clarify the moon card really quick. Tell me about the moon. It's like, things, it's giving weird vibes. That's what it's looking like. It's giving weird vibes. Tell me more about the moon for the collective. Why is the moon showing up for them? Yeah, look, high vibes energy vampires that like to leech off the people that have high vibes like you got good energy there could be a need to try to keep your vibes high too excuse me but the car was upside down um that's what it's looking like tell me about the moon here for the collective tell me more about the moon yeah look the unknown that's what it's looking like. It's like the unknown. It's like certain type of um certain type of um I don't even know what to call it, but it's like the things that you can't that you may not be able to it's like walking amongst you, right? It's like in your energy or around you, but you may not be able to see it, but you can kind of feel or pick up on the energy. And the best way I can explain is, but like um and for some people you may be able to relate to this. But if you're really sensitive to energy, um, you may be able to feel certain type of um, like spirits around you. You may not see it, but you can feel like if you can feel that somebody just like walked into the room and you could be like in the next room, like it just feel like you like you can feel so like somebody's presence, but it may not be nothing there. That could be significant too. That be happening to me all the time. It's like I can tell if something's like moving. And it'd be like kind of scary a little bit too because it's like you can just feel it like it just feels like somebody's like like i could tell somebody's like walking if i cannot see them or hear them like it's kind of weird but um anyway that's the best way i can explain it but um and that's happened to me before too like several times i remember one time i was like sleep or i was kind of like in the middle or i dozed off or something i don't know and it was like after hours, like it felt like a whole bunch of people was like coming in and out, like almost like it was some type of party. And I'm like, what the heck is going on? I just cannot understand. I'm like, why I feel like a whole bunch of people was like coming in and out. That was like really weird. But I was like, yeah, it must be something going on. Tell me more about the moon here for the collective. Look, so by you trusting your intuition when it comes towards the path that you're on or which direction you could be wanting to go on, you're doing a really great job. It's kind of like somebody needing to go to a destination. Are you going somewhere right? But it's like you don't have no type of directions. You only are trusting what your spirit is telling you to do, like your intuition, your higher self. So it's like you're doing a really great job, even if you may not, you may think that you're not, but you actually are. So there could be a lot of false fears and illusions surrounding like you. It's kind of like a back and forth type of situation. It's like you may feel like you're not doing a great job, but you actually are. And, and especially if people are sending you negative energy, you got to be doing something right, right? So yeah, I'm actually in the right here, y'all. But thank you very much for watching.